Diego Chapa. Tex-Mex video, we are Chicanos and proud of it. Genesis 45-1-28, And Joseph could not repress his feelings before all who stood about him, and he called out send every man out of the way, and no man stood with him when Joseph made himself known to his brothers. 2 And he wept aloud, and the Egyptians heard it, and the Pharaoh's palace heard of it. 3 And Joseph said to his brothers I am Joseph, is father still alive? And his brothers could not answer him, because they were in consternation at finding him. 4 And Joseph said to his brothers come close to me, and they did and he said I am your brother Joseph whom you sold into Egypt. 5 And now do not grieve nor think it a sore subject that you sold me here, because God sent me before you for a life preserver. 6 For the famine has been in the country these two years, and there are five years yet that there shall be no plowing and harvesting. 7 And God sent me before you to secure you a remnant in the earth and to keep you alive as a great survival. 8 So it was not you that sent me here, but God, and he has made me father of the Pharaoh and master of all his palace and ruler throughout Egypt. 9 Go right up to father and say to him says your son Joseph, God has made me master of all Egypt, come down to me, do not wait, 10 And live in Goshen and be near me, you and your children and grandchildren and your sheep and goats and cattle and all that belong to you, 11 And I will support you there, because there are five years of famine yet, for fear you and your family and all that belong to you should be impoverished. 12 Hear your eyes see, and my brother Benjamin's eyes, that it is my own mouth that is speaking to you. 13 And you will tell father of all my dignity in Egypt and everything you have seen, and bring father right down here. 14 And he threw himself on his brother Benjamin's neck and wept, and Benjamin wept on his neck. 15 And he kissed all his brothers and wept on them, and after that his brothers talked with him. 16 And the brute was heard in the Pharaoh's palace, Joseph's brothers have come, and the Pharaoh and his officers liked it. 17 And the Pharaoh said to Joseph say to your brothers load your beasts and go. Get to Canaan 18 and take your father and your families and come to me, and I will give you the best there is in Egypt and you shall eat the fat of the land. 19 And give them the order yourself, do this way, take yourselves wagons from Egypt for your children and wives, and take up your father and come. 20 And do not grudge for your things, because the best there is in all Egypt is yours. 21 And Israel's sons did so, and Joseph gave them wagons by the Pharaoh's direction, and gave them provisions for the road. 22 And he gave them all a suit of clothes apiece but to Benjamin he gave three hundred shekels of silver and five suits of clothes. Twenty-three and to his father he sent this, ten jacks carrying Egyptian specialties and ten sheasses carrying grain and bread and provender for his father for the journey. Twenty-four and he sent off his brothers, and they went, and he said to them do not lose your tempers on the road. Twenty-five and they went up from Egypt and came to their father Jacob in Canaan, twenty-six and told him Joseph is still alive, and that he was ruler over all Egypt. And he was stunned, because he did not believe them. 27 And they repeated to him all Joseph's words that he had said to them, and he saw the wagons Joseph had sent to carry him, and their father Jacob's spirit revived. 28 And Israel said that will do, my son Joseph is still alive, I will go and see him before I die. Genesis 46-1-34, And Israel, with all that he had, moved and came to Beersheba and offered sacrifices to his father Isaac's God. 2 And God said to Israel in night visions Jacob, Jacob. And he said here I am. 3 And he said I am the deity, your father's God, do not be afraid of going down to Egypt, because I will make you into a great nation there. 4 I will go down with you to Egypt, and I will bring you up too, and Joseph shall lay his hand on your eyes. 5 And Jacob started from Beersheba, and Israel's sons carried their father Jacob and their children and their wives in the wagons the Pharaoh had sent to carry him. 6 And they took their stock, and the chattels they had acquired in Canaan, and came to Egypt. Jacob and all his issue with him, seven his sons and his grandsons with him, his daughters and his granddaughters, and all his issue he brought with him to Egypt. 8 And these are the names of Israel's sons that came to Egypt, Jacob and his children. 9 Jacob's eldest son was Reuben, and Reuben's sons were Hanak and Palu and Hezron and Carmi. 10 And Simeon's sons were Jemuel and Jaman and Ohad and Jacob and Sohar, and Saul the Canaanite woman's son. 11 And Levi's sons were Gershon, Kohath, and Merari. 12 And Judah's sons were Arnonan and Perez and Zerah, but Arnonan died in Canaan, and Perez's sons were Hezron and Hamul. 13 And Issachar's sons were Tola and Puv and Joshub and Shimron. 14 And Zebulun's sons were Serech and Elon and Jaleel. 15 These were Leah's sons whom she had borne to Jacob in Paddan Aram, and her daughter Dinah, of all the persons, her sons and her daughters, there were 33. 
16 and Gad's sons were Siphjon and Hagi, Shunai and Esben, Eri and Arodi and Areli. 17 and Asher's sons were Imna and Ishvanishvi and Beriah, and their sister Sarah, and Beriah's sons were Haber and Malkiel. 18 These were the sons of Zilpah, whom Laban had given to his daughter Leah and she had borne these to Jacob, 16 persons. 19 The sons of Jacob's wife Rachel were Joseph and Benjamin. 20 And there were born to Joseph in Egypt, born to him by Asenath the daughter of Potiphar the priest of On, Manasseh, and Ephraim. 21 And Benjamin's sons were Bala and Becher and Ashbel, Jerah and Naaman, Ai and Rush, Muppim and Huppim and Art. 22 These were Rachel's sons whom she had born to Jacob, 14 persons in all. 23 And Dan's sons were Hushim. 24 And Naphtali's sons were Jezeel and Guni and Jesser and Shilam. 25 These were the sons of Bilha, whom Laban had given to his daughter Rachel and she had borne these to Jacob, seven persons in all. 26 Of all the persons of Jacob's that came to Egypt, the issue of his body, aside from Jacob's sons' wives, the total was 66 persons. 27 And Joseph's sons who had been born to him in Egypt were two persons, the total of the persons of Jacob's family that came to Egypt was 70. 28 And he sent Judah ahead to Joseph to have him send instructions to Goshen ahead of him, and they came to Goshen. 29 And Joseph harnessed his chariot and went up to meet his father Israel in Goshen, and appeared to him and threw himself on his neck and kept weeping on his neck. 30 And Israel said to Joseph Now let me die, now that I have seen your face and seen you are still alive. 31 And Joseph said to his brothers I will go up and report to the Pharaoh my brothers and family who are in Cain and have come to me. 32 And the men are shepherds because they have been stockmen, and they have brought their sheep and goats and everything they had. 33 And when the Pharaoh summons you and says what is your business? 34 Say your servants have been stockmen from our boyhood till now, both we and our fathers, in order that you may settle in Goshen, for every shepherd is an abomination to the Egyptians. Diego Chapa. Tex-Mex Video. We are Chicanos and proud of it.